What's new, YouTube? It's your boy Seth with Urban Source. Got another good one for you. Ah, y'all, we back. <laughs> I had to be all extra loud for no reason. This is our second, second Christmas Day song, y'all. I just found out that I forgot to do my Wednesday videos, so you're gonna get a lot of videos today. You're gonna get a Wednesday day, you're gonna get Thursday, and you'll get the Friday. It's all dropped today, y'all, so. Um, that means y'all haven't heard none of the rock videos yet. None of them. And, um,. At the time I'm recording this, I just haven't dropped them yet. I've already done them. I just haven't dropped them. So, um, yeah, you're going to get a lot of videos today. So, Merry Christmas to y'all. Tell, tell, make sure to let everybody know in the YouTube community, only the Urban Experience can do this. <laughs> but like, comment, subscribe, please. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you. I'm new to YouTube, trying to grow big here. Uh, Seven months and the end of December will be eight. So please subscribe. I'm organic. I don't promote my channel, so it's all organic. Your subscription means so much more. I appreciate it. All right, Rage Against the Machine, man. So I gotta apologize, y'all. I want to say something. First thing, two apologies. Rage is fire. Okay, they, they're fire. I, I admit, I, I give up. I give in. <laughs> they're they're fire. Second thing, uh, you already know to be a staple on my channel, you gotta go through the the, the five song uh, battle. We gotta have five songs in a row that's bangers each week, and then once you do that, you can be a staple. I had already did five, and I didn't know that. I was, this was supposed to be the fifth one, and I was about to be all extra like, "Ooh, I don't think Rage gonna get it." To be fair, I've already done five, and they've all been bangers. So you know, go check all those songs. I was counting them up. I'm like, "Dang, I did five? That's crazy!" So they've all been bangers, and Rage have been uh, they're a regular every Thursday officially, officially. So yeah, I hope y'all, man, I hope y'all ain't been taking me down the wrong road. Man. I know y'all, y'all went through, hope y'all didn't go through all their songs and pick the best five and send them to me. <laughs> and now I'm about to hear all this trash. I hope that, I hope that's not the case, Jack. <laughs> but uh, today we're doing Wake Up, we're about to find out. And um, after this we're doing Linkin Park. And then, uh, yeah, we ain't gonna talk your head off. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. I know you saw the Christmas intro, but this is Christmas representing the Rock Thursday. It's Christmas, so I had to do a Christmas intro. And uh, here we go. This sounds familiar. Make sure I do a lyric video because this don't look like the lyric video. I, be, I know y'all be getting on me if I don't do the lyric video. Hold on. Copy. I'm going to start this over. I'm doing this live, y'all. Lyrics. The lyrics? Okay. This one look cooler, though. I'm do this one. <laughs> Six minutes, they don't usually have long videos, so this is gonna be interesting. my Christmas hat. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> y'all y'all right, man. Ray don't be having all that. One thing I love about Ray, they're one of the very rare groups that all their beats be bangers. Like all of them. All of the instruments and everything. That's tough. That's definitely tough. That's very rare. I haven't heard that in almost any rock group I've ever heard. Even Lincoln Park sometime Chester has to come through to make the song fire. <laughs> because the song because the song beat be just okay. But this is the hey everyone everyone I've done been fire like dang that's tough that's tough 
You, you, hey, Lincoln Park's still better, so chill. <laughs> but they, they, y'all tough, though, man. That's all I'm going to say. Y'all definitely in top five of all time to me so far. I got to check out. Like I said, I got to make sure y'all ain't, y'all ain't okie-doking me and giving me only their best bet. I got to see what I see what happened when they started giving their trash songs. Like, everybody got a trash song. I don't care what y'all say. Even Lincoln Park. I want to find out when I hit that trash song what everybody going to say then. <laughs> Enjoy the shit out of this song. <laughs> somebody die it's I don't know what he mean by heads are flown I'm thinking he mean when they die they went to when that somebody die and everybody kind of slow down their movements and stuff that's when you're supposed to bring up the man come on man bars Kendrick, I dare you to go let's take this beat and remix it for a rap CD. <laughs> by that is each line is extremely detailed in what he's trying to say you know what i'm saying and clearly he has a little anger behind his toward the government so <laughs> i get it and lauren was more focused on toward uh the black people movement but lauren was way before we were doing all this black Lives matter stuff now she was back in the day she was talking about this stuff you know I mean? he's talking about he got, he got a lot of that in this too you know what I'm saying? But he's just talking about just, just, just corruption. Just pure corruption. Like, all the songs I've done was just all talking about corruption. But the detail in writing is phenomenal. It's very interesting. They're very, they're very different than the Lincoln Park when it comes down to what they um, talk about. Because Lincoln Park is more emotional. And that's probably why they, get, they, they, they gravitized to me so strong when I first heard Lincoln Park for the first time. And this one is more corruption, you know what I'm saying? But 
what make them gravitate to me is the way they got the beats and the flows and the rock and that don't. Mm, mm. <laughs> I would love to go to a concert there. I don't think they're doing stuff anymore because this was a long time ago. But I would definitely love to go to a concert of theirs. Anyway, I'm sorry, y'all. I do want to say this, and I don't care what they got to say about it. They can suck it. They're better than Led Zeppelin. Far. That, that, that's easy for me. There ain't no doubt in my mind. <laughs> I know y'all might be y'all might be Led Zeppelin fans and Rage fans. Y'all might have a little something to say about this. Whatever. <laughs> I think Rage is better than Led. That's my personal opinion. Make sure you you listen to what the hell they got to say. <laughs> Facts. questions I had a homework assignment and a question whatever happened to this guy you know what I'm saying the main guy doing all the rapping and stuff saying something usually history repeats themselves people who usually puts up that much of a commotion people try to silence 
you know, but just based off of history. So I wondered it. What, whatever happened to this guy? Is he still around? You know what I'm saying? Is um, he still doing, you know, Black Lives Just movements toward the government still? Or did he get his message across to his satisfaction? Or do the group still do tours? Like, I don't know. I don't know anything. You know what I'm saying? So they're a staple on my channel. So I got to start educating me now. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, let me know in the comments below what, whatever happened to this guy. Second question. So they're a staple now. The Lincoln Park people, they did me good. The 21 Pilot people did me good. Rage, if y'all are real fans, help a brother out. I need a detailed list. I, I, like, I like the way that um, what's name did it for um, 21 Pilots. He went CD for CD and did the top hits. He, he specified which ones I should do. If I should do the live one, if I should do the lyrical one, if I should do the, the music video. If I should do a mixture of two, you know what I'm saying? He he, he specified in which ones and which order. And then he just made a nice long list and it made it, made it easy for me because I just followed the list. So, um, I don't know if multiple people want to create a list. I don't know. Uh, maybe y'all can piggyback off each other's ideas or whatever. You know, real Rage fans know Rage the best. So, y'all know which ones, I, the way I follow. Y'all know I like great beats. So, just throwing it out there. <laughs> but uh, I would like to go through their discography now. So, we're going we're gonna to try to hit CD for CD. Uh, let's start off with the first one, and then we're going to go straight in order. Y'all just tell me which order of songs I should do and which order. They don't have to be in the order of the same CD. You know, if you want me to do five before I do one, before I do 16, it don't, it don't matter. Whichever songs you think I should do first. I recommend five per CD. But uh, if you feel like there's a few other ones on that CD that I definitely should check out, def definitely put it in the list also. Um, yeah, I know I've been getting random songs here and there from a lot of people, but a list is important now because they're a staple. You know, I'm doing every Thursday, you're going to get a new range. So this is number six already. So um, yeah, go ahead and give me that list, y'all. I appreciate it, man. And um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe. We out. Oh, Merry Christmas. From the urban experience, where we do things the urban way, I'm out.